So we are here at a scenic overlook, 95, State Road 95, going north in Idaho. And it says this is the Hawaii country. The name applied to these mountains and the whole surrounding region is an outdated spelling of the word Hawaii. Interesting. I don't know if that means it's mile post 192 or not. Right Let's go but to this. This is point. a scenic outlook. So we're going to go up. There's like a trail along that fence right there. We're going to go up to the top and videotape. So we came up this hill here on the fence. It comes up to right here in the corner of the fence. Jake decided he'd go up the other side. And you can just see the scenic view here. It's a little cloudy, but it's still really nice. Hopefully this isn't too windy on the camera. There's like this little windy road right there. Jake's going out to this little rocky patch there. I can just picture him right now holding up the, the baby lion and singing the Lion King song. This is kind of a brake check area that we are stopping out as well. You can see some interesting little like tire tracks down there. <laughs> I don't know if that's from like four wheelers or what. Maybe somebody with a Jeep might like to ride through here. I don't know. But this is just so wild. It's like a valley right down in there. This goes all through that way little tiny bit of snow still on the top of that mountain like right up, up there <laughs> uh, I can take a picture of you while I'm videotaping oh, like on my phone. Oh, on your phone okay oh, we'll do that oh, I still zoomed in there. can see the mountains far off. It's crazy because this is... That's where we're about to go down the road right there through that cut. Hawaii mountains in Idaho. Never even heard of them before. All right, now we're going to leave that scenic area. It was like a brake test area. Checked all our brakes and all that stuff. So now we're headed down through this little ravine. Not ravine. What would this be called? A uh, gorge. A gorge. Yeah, I guess it would be called a gorge. You turn the For me, I was out on the rock. Did you film me on the rock? Yeah. Yeah, my face is like numb. It was awesome though. Fun place to co contemplate your life or what you're doing in life. Wait for this truck to go by. Even though this is the brake check area. There he goes. And Kip's gonna put together some of the videos from the cruise. Maybe. <laughs> Well, I do have some videos of the cruise. I don't even really know. I have to go through what I got. Sorry that it's bumpy. It's like shaking. And so, we'll see what I can do. I might be able to put together a little bit of cruise stuff. But I mean, this is really pretty through here. As always, the, the most difficult places to drive is using the best places for views. Yep, that's how it goes. Not approved. Drive to work line behind you or rear from current location. Oh, he's at a road. Well, now our GPS is really screwed up. It thinks we're out in the middle of the desert somewhere or something. I don't know. Well, look at all the salt inside that thing that there. Big pile of grit, big pile of salt. I guess when they get bad roads. some of the locals at a diner we stopped at earlier and they believe that spring's kind of here. 
do you think their winter's over out here? I would guess so. Uh, ouch. This is so much fun. Wow, look at how beautiful this is. I just wish it was a more clearer day. But being cloudy, you don't get to see as much. Nope. back in the day when they had to cut through these rocks to make these roads or even back in the day when the people were like wagons came through here they had to deal with these I would imagine they would have to go around somehow I can't imagine going through an area like this with a wagon that'd be crazy and there was no roads or nothing figured out a way to do it. Goodbye. Let's say make every day an adventure and dream big. We'll see you on the next one.